Hello, my name is Marissa, and today I'm going to be showing you guys how I install my custom content. Um, this is just very simple, very simple tutorial on how I personally install my custom content onto my Mac. So what we're first going to do is we're going to go into is this it? Um, this this place right here. We're gonna go back on this just because we don't need that right at the moment. Okay. So this is where I'm going to be downloading things. But um, So the first thing you're going to need is you're going to need either Kekka for the Mac or WinRAR if you have a Windows 7 or below. Um, but if you have a Windows 8, I don't believe you need um, any form of um, package converter or anything, or not a converter, um, compressor, file compressor, anything like that. So you're just going to want to download whichever one. If you're a 32-bit, you're going to want to download that. Or if you're a 64-bit, they also have ones for that. You're going to want to know which, you, which one you are. Um, just Google that. You'll definitely find it. They also have some for uh, Macs, but I highly recommend getting Kekka if you have a Mac. All of this will be in the description down below. So you're just going to want to download. It will download, and then it will show up in your downloading stuff, pretty much. So once that is done, once you've downloaded that and, and installed it, you remember you have to install it, not just download. Um, so once that is installed, you will be able to compress your files and things like that. So the first website I really want to show you guys is this one. This will have everything you need for it. I've already downloaded it. All you're going to want to do is press this download button. This will also be in the description. Um, oh, something just popped up. No thanks. Um, <laughs> um, so this will also be in the description down below. And you just you if you want to read, you can read it. This just has to do with something about monkey crap. I don't know. Um, and this will show you pretty much where to find it, how to work it, blah, blah, blah. So you're just going to want to press download. And it will download automatically. I already think I already have it downloaded. Oh, you're, you're right here. So it will download and it will be this thing called mods um, and mods one mods two. I have it down here. This is the first one that I download. I'm just going to click on this one. They are all the same. So I'm not trying to trick you or anything like that. Um, and I'm just going to double click it and this will show up. Um, this is all you need. You're going to need this mods folder right here. Um, this is the mods folder. And you're going to want to put this. I'm going to show you where to put it, but you're going to need overrides package and this. This will all show up. This is if you do this like hand by hand, you're gonna have to make all these files. But since we've downloaded this, um, this is how it works. So what we're going to do is we're going to open up our uh, documents, and we're going to go into Electronic Arts, The Sims 3, and then in here you're going to want to put your um, package file. So we're going to just drag and drop into this. Now you're going to figure out very soon that you do not have the mods folder. If you do, you're going to want to delete it. Um, this is mine already installed. So I have the packages, I have the overrides, and I have all of that in there already. So the other thing I'm going to show you, just for test runs, I guess, um, you're going to go into packages and you're going to go into this and it's going to have two um, just kind of like, I guess it's, um, I don't know what the word is, I forgot, just testing to see if it works. Um, it's the no build sparkles and the no intro. The no intro would be the easiest one. You're not going to see that um, where the sims are like, where the, the girl touches the pregnant belly or, you know, it's, it, the Sims are at the beach or whatever, that whole little spiel right before. Um, that's not going to be there. And also the plum bob thing that turns into the Sim 3 will not be there. It will just go straight into um, loading your game. Um, and then the no build sparkles is just when you put down a wall or something like that. You know how it has sparkles at the very end? These are just two things to test to see if it's working. Um, and obviously it does work if you do it correctly. Um, so when we're done with that, um, we're just going to go into my package files and these are all my package files right now. I've just learned how to do this, so don't, don't hate me. Um, 
so right now we're going to go and we're going to install something. Yay! So I've already, I'm in Anubis Under the Sun or Anubis360.blogspot.com. I'll put this also in the description. Um, and we are going to download this package file. I don't download Sim 3 pack files. I download the package just because, you know, just, just how I do it. And this page will pop up when you uh, press the download button. So we're just going to download. It's going to download into here. We're just going to wait for it to download. Download, download. There we go. We're going to show in folder. We're going to extract this file, put it into documents just so we don't lose it. Um, and when we do that, we're going to double click it. And it's going to extract the um, folders within it. And you'll see that it has a picture of the thing, and it has the pack file, or the package file, excuse me. So we're going to go into Electronic Arts, where we went before, The Sims 3. And then we're going to go into, oh, we'll put it in The Sims 3 for now. And then we're going to find your mods folder. And we're just going to drag and drop it into your package files. And once it's in there, it's in there. And that's uh, all you have to do. So I'm going to show you how this works. Um, we're just going to shut this. And then this is a pop-up. Awesome. Um, we're going to go into The Sims. Alright, so we're opening up the file right now. Opening up The Sims 3. It's going to take a little bit to load. Just because I just had to update it, it wouldn't it, it would not load. So yes, now we are going to upload not upload, but open this baby up. It's just gonna be like this for a second, and then it's gonna go straight into this, and then it'll go straight into loading. You'll see. So once it goes straight into loading, there we go. Straight into loading. Look at that. Amazing. Okay, so now that it is straight into loading, we're just going to talk for a couple of seconds about stuff. Um, so let me know if you think this tutorial was easy or hard. Um, if it was hard to follow, let me know, because I know I do ramble a lot. Um, I apologize for that, but hopefully you guys can follow. I will also put everything in the description like step by step pretty much because I know I do talk really fast and I talk I ramble a lot um, feel free to check out my other videos I am a simmer mostly I don't really do much of anything else except I do have another channel um, which is Mr. Twigs it's it it's my beauty channel um, if you guys want to see my face you can go on that one um, that is my beauty channel. Um, I do just some stupid review videos on there. I'm not very interesting at all. Um, so yeah. So now we're just going to wait for this to load. Um, and I do apologize for the the cutout, I guess. Um, it it crashed. It, my, my game crashed because I it had to install, or not install, but up to, or patch the Island Paradise expansion pack, I guess. Um, so it, like, crashed, and then I had to, like, I don't know what I had to do, but I had to patch the game or whatever. So now it's working. Awesome possum. Um, we're just going to wait for it to load. Waiting for it to load. And I'm going to show you um, where it is in your game. So remember, we did download that um, the dress with the skirt attached and I'm going to show you where it will be in your game. Um, we did download it for a young adult so I could show you my sim wearing it. Okay, there we go. Look at that. Beautiful, beautiful. We're going to click on that. Um, just so I could show you on my sim um, where it is. Blah, blah, blah. My sim is in university. I really did not play university when it first came out. Um, just because I thought it was so tedious and boring. But she really looks like Natasha Romanoff, a.k.a. Black Widow, a.k.a. Scarlett Johansson in the Hollywood version of the Marvel comic The Avengers. Um, 
Yeah, so she really did look like Natasha Romanoff, and I was like, you know what? We're going to name her Natasha Romanoff. And then I put her in the military career, and now I was like, well, she really has to work on her athletic skill and stuff like that. So we're mastering her in her athletic skill and her martial arts skill. So, yeah. Now it's just going to load and take forever. Um, sorry I haven't uploaded a video in a very long time. I did have a couple of, like, tutorials, um, like, pre-made, but I just ended up not liking any of them. I thought they were all kind of stupid. Um, so I just did not. Let me know if you guys want me to show you where I get most of my custom content. Um, I'll make a video on that, like, the different web pages I go. Um... But other than that, I don't know what else to talk about. Please load faster so I don't don't bore people. Okay. There we go. Oh my gosh, load please. I'm so hungry right now. I need to go eat something. Okay, so it might be a little bit glitchy and a little bit, like, not graphic at all. Um, just because I did just, um, do the patch, so... Yeah, so we're gonna do testing cheats enabled, just so I can do this faster. Um... We're going to edit her and create a sim. Yeah, it's really glitchy right now. So this might take a little bit to upload or and to load at all. So this is my sim. She, I feel like she looks like exactly like Natasha Romanoff. Uh, I have no idea, idea why. I just do. Just probably because of her hair. Um, we're going to go into clothing. But we do change. Uh, her hair does change. But I like this her workout outfit. I thought it was very bad bitch. Kind of. <laughs> Awkward. Okay. So just I'm just gonna let it load for a second. Load please. Load please. Load load. There we go. Okay, and we're gonna try to find this. Is it... Should, is it this one? No, it's not that one. Um, so it is a dress. I do you remember what it looked like? We're just gonna have to scroll through everything. Is this it? No, that is not it. Oh, oh, there it is. Is this it? Yes, it is. Okay, and here it is. Look at that. There it is. How pretty. There it is. So, and yeah, I like her black boots with that. But, so, there you guys go. This is how it is installed. Um, and as you can see, it's actually very simple. You just have to drag and drop that package file into your mods. Um, and it will just automatically be inside the game. So, yeah. That is it. That is basically my tutorial. Um, thank you guys for watching and sticking with me. Um, yeah, so thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you all have a super fantastic, fabulous, exotic, beautiful day. Um, and just leave a comment down below, like it if you, if it helped you. Um, yeah, anyway, so thank you guys so much for watching, and I'll talk to y'all later. Bye!